a joke. I feel so robbed right now. Welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a Luxie hair extension review. So if you're interested in knowing about my experience with Luxie hair, then just keep watching. You already know what the title is, so you already know that this is a fail. And me in post editing, I already know that this is a fail. But when I was actually getting these, I was very excited and extremely hopeful. So. Let's pretend like we don't already know what's going to happen and I will walk you through my process of buying these hair extensions. So first thing I do, I go straight to Google Luxie hair extensions. I already knew what I wanted. I already knew I was going to try this brand. If you scroll down, the website's really cute. It shows you actually who wears these hair extensions and bitch okay kim kardashian is wearing these hair extensions is that what you're telling me right now all these cute girls all their hair looks so cute so i'm like yes me help me choose i don't know what i'm doing it takes you through a little step by step which is cute so i wanted to add volume and length okay and in the next slide it shows you short or long hair i have short hair if i'm looking at this diagram okay so i click it Thick, bitch, thick hair. It has a cute little section to pick out your color. I purchased these at the beginning of this week and I actually got them yesterday in the mail. And this is what it looks like. I'm gonna cover my address for you guys. So inside, I have my return slip in case they don't work and also the box. And inside here, we have our test strip. And then behind that, we have our hair and our box. This is gonna be your hair extension weft that you get to try with your actual hair before you open the full box. Because once you open the box, you actually can't return the hair. Right off the bat, I have owned a lot of hair before, all kinds of hair extensions. I used to order off of um, this Chinese website and I know like people always wanna talk junk about Chinese hair sites, but it was the best hair extensions I've ever had. I dyed them so many times and they lasted so long, but I did have Bellamy hair at one point and I was kind of disappointed with those. So these are really soft. It comes with a nice little curl already in it. That's cute. Color wise, looks pretty good. Yes, cute, I like it. I did get the 220 gram set in mocha. So that looks like it would definitely work. The band right here is pretty thick and I have had the ones where the clips are just sewn onto the weft and they do tend to fall apart pretty easily. So hopefully these don't. Ooh. So now that we've seen the tester piece, I definitely want to open these. And it does say right here, I just want to note that it says you cannot exchange or return once this is opened. This top part is going to come out and your hair extensions are going to be right inside. They're also in this hairnet, which normally hair extensions come in that. As far as storage goes, this is really cool. I like that. First impressions. It's not as thick as I thought it would be, to be honest with you. I have had 220 gram hair extensions before and I feel like my hair is super thick. So I'm hoping that this is going to actually do something because I feel like I would want just one of these on one side of my head. So I'm kind of nervous about that, but overall it's really soft. The color is perfect. So we're gonna actually put these in uh, as a demo so I can show you exactly what they look like. And also for me, cause I've never put these in. So overall we have two four clips, two three clips, two two clips, and four one clips. And honestly, I'd much rather have another three clip 
or another two clip. I'm not a big fan of one clips, just not my thing. I straightened my hair out for this just so I could, could have the straightest amount of hair possible so we can actually see how these look because normally this is how I'm gonna wear them. I just am not a fan. <sighs> I have a lot of hair, okay? I have a lot of hair, which is why I got the 220 grams, but when I'm just looking at this, it just does not seem like 220 grams. I just, I don't know, man. I just don't feel like this is enough hair. I've had 220 gram extensions before, and I've not really had to do this before. I just don't, I mean, look at this, you guys. Look how much hair I have. I've already used three pieces. I already have three pieces in my hair and you cannot even tell. I'm gonna be so mad if I just spent almost $300 on hair and it's not even enough hair. Like, this is my last big clip. This looks like, like what? Look how stringy it is. Like, it doesn't even look like I have hair in. This is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. I'm just gonna put these in. I already know I hate them, but I'm just gonna put them in. How is this 220 grams? Honestly, how the f is this 220 grams? I am like so pissed off right now. Well, this is with every piece in my head right now. Look at that, what? Where is the hair? Where is the hair? I'm seriously about to cry right now. Like, really? This seriously has to be a joke. Did I even get the right ones? This looks so bad. Ew. You best believe I put this on the internet. It looks so good when you look at yourself in a camera, but can I just show you? Because look at the thickness version between, look at that, look at this. This is how much hair you get. This is 220 grams. Oh. Do not waste your money because this is ridiculous. I could have seriously bought the Bellamy hair and it would have at least covered my head. What? This is not a full head of hair. This is somebody with thin hair. This would be enough for them, which is why I'm just thinking to myself, this cannot be my order. 220 grams and I was supposed to get hair clips. So I was supposed to get hair clips. Those didn't come. Like, I can see all of my hair, literally. I can see it. And I feel like this is exactly why the one clips piss me off because I would have much rather preferred to have a giant weft, a volumizing weft, and then put two four clips, two three clips, and two two clips. That would have been enough hair for me. I feel so robbed right now. It's not even thick on the ends. Like, 
I can see all of my hair back here. And look, just to satisfy you guys, because I know you're going to sit here and talk like I did something wrong. I am 26 years old. I have been wearing hair extensions for 10 years, okay? Like, it's not even cute. I wanna cry. And now that I tried it on, I can't return it because I put it on my head. And you would have never known that it wouldn't be enough hair if I would have never put it on my head. If you think about ordering this hair, don't. Just don't. I would rather go for Bellamy hair than this. And this is more expensive. And that's what is killing me is that I just spent over $200 on hair extensions. Like a dumb to get this stupid it, look how thin this is. I hope that if somebody from Luxy Hair is watching this, maybe these reviews that are saying that this is great hair, sure, maybe the hair is good, it is soft, it is nice, but you're not putting enough hair in here to label this as 220 grams. Point of this review, don't buy the hair. Don't do it. Don't waste your money. Well, you guys, I'm so sorry that this was such an extremely unpleasant video. They had such a pleasant shipping experience and a shopping experience that for me to get my hair finally and be disappointed as a customer is just honestly so annoying. Normally I get 250, but to be quite honest with you, 30 grams is not that big of a difference between 220 and 250. And they didn't have a 250 option for me, which is why I went with the 220 because that's what the site recommended for me. I am 100% disappointed. I feel like my money has been completely wasted. This was a total waste, but at least something good can come out of this because now you know not to buy this hair. So that's my review. So that's all I have to say about that. If you guys liked this video, give it a like. If I actually gave you some insight and changed your mind on purchasing this hair, I'd really appreciate it if you would give me a like because I feel like the more people that see this video, hopefully the less people will be buying from this company. And yeah, I'm disappointed, I'm pissed off. I just wasted money, so bye.